Hey guys, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 3 here yes. in Sunlit Tides with Gustav and Braylon Hart. Um, Gustav is getting ready to write a sci-fi novel. He's going to name it AG263, I guess. I don't really care about the name, but um, he's reached level, writing level 2. And he finished writing his last book at the end of the last one. And it says, uh, just finished writing Castles Beyond Creel, a work of nonfiction. Some have compared to the first edition of Predictions of the Future. Unfortunately for Gustav, the writing profession is a difficult landscape filled with disappointment and hardship. Flops like Castles Beyond Crenellation won't ease the situation. He'll re receive six payments of $11. Well, that kind of sucks. Um, and he penned his first novel, which is good. What is Raylan doing now? Oh, she's still just gardening. Um, we actually can turn these off now. They've been on for a while. And they only really have to go on for like a minute, and then that's about it. But we left him on for a little while. She actually has an uh, got an opportunity to deliver a zero, deliver three garlic. She has to do that by Thursday, so we may need to go find a garlic plant because. I think I checked, and we don't have one. Uh, I'm not seeing one. But you never really know. <laughs> Sometimes you can miss it. See, all these are unknown plants. And I think, if I remember correctly, garlic is one of the plants that you don't know until it's actually, like, full-grown. If she doesn't get the opportunity completed, oh well, she doesn't get it. She doesn't get it completed. Not a big deal. Um, yeah. So he's writing in here. What's his? He wants to improve his writing skill and write a book worth at least thirty books, thirty dollars a week in royalties. Well, this is seven fifty. This is a thousand. So we're gonna take that out. Seven fifty. Um, twenty five dollars. <clears throat> we'll just put it here in this place because I do want him to earn some money from his blogging. You know what we need to do actually? I think it's a new day so he needs to do his uh, he needs to ask his followers for some donations and he needs to um, browse the web and then he needs to why do I keep that? stream videos. Will you not break that laptop? We just bought that not too long ago. And she wants to have her first child. Well, we can do that. 5,000? Oh, jeez. Alright. I guess we'll get rid of that and we'll get... <laughs> well, she's going to have her first child, so obviously you might as well lock it in. Because you know it's an inevitable points that you're going to get. So, Alright, come on. Oh, These plants had better hurry up. Oh, well, not those ones. Where are the ones that we don't know what they are? <laughs> Not really sure. All right, so he's earned fifteen dollars for submitting some chapters, which is good. That means the book is going well. He is getting there slowly but surely. Probably not going to finish that today. All right, girl, how's it going out here? What skill level is she on? I think she's on eight. Yeah, she is. She is on eight, and she is working her way around here. Now I gotta make sure that she's getting to this plant here because it's a rare plant and we don't want her to give that one up. So it's not saying it needs to have anything done to it so I think she's actually tending to it. The rare and the special ones are the ones that you really want to pay attention to because they're the ones that are worth a lot more money. Um, obviously she's not going to have this much time. This is why I wanted him to uh, be able to garden. Because she's not going to be able to spend all her day out here when she has the baby. So, uh -huh. let's see. He got another $15 uh -huh. for submitting some chapters. Um, he really... We really need to get... You know what? I'm going to mm. buy them. Mm. And I know I'm wasting their money here. We need to get... I'm just going to buy them um, a multi-tab. Because with a multi-tab, he can order a book online. Not going to actually probably use it for anything other yeah. than that. Oh, gosh. The baby is coming, and she is in the garden. Selma. No, I don't think she said that. All right, well, 
the baby's on its way. He better stop doing this writing. Obviously. He just got something, though. Um. Harb. Buy a dartboard? No. We can pillow fight with a sim, though. We could do that with your wife. Okay, what's he doing over here? He improved his writing to level 3, which is good. And he asked his followers for donations. She is loud. Alright, girl, come on. Push that thing out. We want to know if it's a boy or a girl. I actually sped her up. He's going to use the bathroom. Oh, look at him up there. He's just taking care of his needs. Alright, let's get him to shop online for books after he's done. And I think he's done. And you know what? We're going to let him go outside and freak out because his life is going into labor. Then go here. Uh-oh. We got stinky food. Alright, you know what we need to do? It's, uh, what was the skill? Recipes. You know what? We could buy all these, but we're probably just going to learn them. Um, alchemy recipe tree skills. We want a gardening skill, please. Gardening skill book, gardening skill. Gardening volume one. That's exactly what we wanted. All right, buddy. Harb. Ah. He is going to start to freak when he gets out here because she is in labor. Ah. Oh, he really doesn't care, I guess. <laughs> All right, buddy. Let's get you to uh, clean out this bad food because we do not want that in there. And you know what? She's probably hungry. So let's get him to cook some dinner. Serve. Well, you know what? Serve some macaroni and cheese. I don't think he's got the cooking skill, but I think he'll be okay. I don't think he'll, uh, he'll burn the house down while she's in labor. Hopefully not, anyways. Alright, here it comes. Boy or girl? It's a girl, and she got her 5,000 points, and the baby has been born with a discipline and brave traits because she's not been in the greatest mood. Um, we're going to name her Brenna. All right. So, Brenna was just crying, and now she's asleep. Yep, I'm sure she would be. Well, they're about all up anyways, so we're going to fast forward through this. When Gustav gets up, he's going to take care of his needs in the bathroom, and what the heck is going on out here? Oh, God, this dog is chewing this newspaper, Oh, and he's going to need to clean that up because that dog, and she wants to finish a book. Sure you can. Um, she really doesn't need much. Let's see, what time is he getting up? Nine. All right, she's got a little bit of time to use this... Uh, bathroom. Then she's going to take care of her hunger, obviously. Um, then let's let her get the mail. And then we're going to take care of Brenna's needs because she needs a bottle and she needs social. Play with. Snuggle. Well, you know what? Take a shower somewhere else, okay? <laughs> shower here when you're done with Brenna. And, oh, she's got the imaginary friend. All right, buddy, we don't need to hear you singing in the shower. All right, let's see. So, she's going to eat her mac and cheese that Gustav made her last night, which was very sweet. And I hope you did not make this shower. You did, too. You need to clean that. She is in a bad, bad mood. All right, come on. You got to take care of your baby. No mail. We get that. Do that later. All right, then get the mail. She is going to go take care of her next. What's he doing? He is cleaning up this bathroom. And then we're going to have him clean up this newspaper. We'll have him read this newspaper. And sure, check the weather. Then let's get him to continue writing his book. All right, so the baby should be happier. Well... Her hunger didn't really go up. Oh, there it goes. Alright. So she's going to just take care of the baby. And then she needs to go back outside and continue with her garden. 
Um, I wanted to know where I planted those rare seeds, and I think I did it over here. But these are not showing up as rare. Oh, these are the special seeds. All right. I want to know what these are, but there's nothing there really. So the first thing we're gonna do is have her tend the garden on that side today, just because I don't think it got done yesterday. We're gonna turn on the sprinklers because they need to be turned on for the garden. And yeah, Brenna is all better now, and she's in the boys' crib. Well, you know what? Put her back in her own crib. Hold her. Oh look, it's in the newspaper that we had a girl and her name is Brenna. Aww. Alright, where are you at? He needs to eat some eat some leftovers when he's done. And that's just about the horses. Alright. Please put your daughter in the girl's crib, not in the boy's crib this time. And then let's get you to get the mail, which has got her imaginary friend in it. And then we're going to come over here and tend to the garden. Alright, so that's good. Now she's back in her own crib. That's good. Can you set this? Oh, that would have been nice if you could have set the crib to the certain child. But you can't. Alright, well, now she's going to be cranky because she's yellow. And let's see what she needs. She probably needs a diaper changed. All right, buddy, you need to uh, take care of your daughter. So you need to uh, heavy rain today. Mm -hmm. Change the dirty diaper, and then snuggle her back to sleep. And then you need to eat your leftovers, <laughs> clean this dish up, and then um, writing, continue. Actually going to pull this over so he cleans up any dishes that are in there. Uh, and good. Gustav's book is here, actually. So we what? can travel to Egypt now if we wanted. Let's let her give him his book. Where is it? Oh, no, no. Gustav's oh, book oh. is right there. Hmm. Alright, well, he should be able to go to China now. Oh, shoot. It really bugs me if they don't put him in the same crib. Alright, buddy. Oh, then you can eat your leftovers. This up with. Clean up all this. Then continue writing this book. Oh, you know what? He never joined the book club. Eleven dollars. Oh, he earned his book royalties. All right. All right, girl. How's it going out here? Um, she needs fun, but I don't really know. She's got to do this though, or the garden will start to die. And I don't want that to happen. We took all of our time to plant it. We might as well get it going. He really needs to learn the gardening skill, though. Um, we might actually have him travel. Let's see. We'll see if he can do it after he does all that. Alright, what's she doing out here? She's still just gardening. And Brenna is just laying in her crib. She ain't got nothing better to do in her life. But she's got her imaginary friend with her, whose name is Buddy. <laughs> So, she is happy. She's a happy baby. Yeah. And he just submitted some more chapters, which gave us $15. It's nice. Speed up a little bit faster. I don't want to watch them forever. Alright, so she is really just getting the gardening going. Though she has to water these plants because there's no, um... Because there's no sprinkler over here. You know what? These are really loud. Let's turn these off. We don't need them on anymore. I'm pretty sure the wa plants are watered and they are happy. So we don't need the water on anymore. Alright. $15 more he's earned for submitting a couple more chapters. And he's reached level 4 of gardening. Would Gustav like to join the book club? Joining the book club means that you have to pay a tune. Yes, absolutely. Alright. And we'll be mailed books from the book club on Wednesdays. Now, he wants to go to Egypt. Right? I think it was Egypt. Egypt and, uh... Um, sure, Gustav. You may go to Egypt. Hmm. Isn't that... Yeah, he had to go to Egypt. Alright. So, we're going to be going with Gustav to Egypt. 
We're pretty much just going to go there to give off the book, and that's pretty much it. We're not going to really do much else. Um, we'll buy recipes and stuff from there, but we'll do the adventures with um, Braylon because she needs that for her lifetime wish. Um, we'll come back when Gustav has arrived in Egypt. All right, so we're here in Egypt now <clears throat> with Gustav. Wow, it looks hot here. Um, okay, we're just going to let this play through. And this is the base camp here in Egypt. It's just pretty much tents. There's not much really here. But the first thing we're going to do with Gustav is deliver this book. Alright, buddy, go ahead. Go deliver your book. And he has just visited Egypt. Yeah, we know. All right. We're going to deliver this book. What does he want to do? Visit the temple of Queen something or other. No. We're not doing that. Um, oh, it's a little girl. All right. So this must be the person that we're coming to. <laughs> the folly guard. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, buddy. Port two. Mm -hmm. Eshtu. Talk it out with her. Alright, so that was only worth $100. So we only have 941 But what we're going to do is we're going to head down to the the market. Yeah, go to the Al Samhara market. And we're going to go see if we can buy stuff for the house. Well, like the recipes and stuff. So we have all the foreign recipes that we can make. He still wants to get donations from his followers, but we haven't gotten anything yet. Hopefully soon. He'll start getting some stuff. Oh, him and his flip-flops. Alright, so we are here at the market. And let's see, where is the first place we need to go? What's this one? This is the food, right? Yeah, that's food. We don't want food. Um, the general stores. All right, let's go there and see what we can buy. And then we can go over here. This is the bookstore, I'm pretty sure. And we're going to buy there. What's this one? Relic? Well, I don't really think we need a relic, so. Let's go ahead and see what we can get. All right, we're going to follow him. He's just going in here. We know. Alright. Come on. Alright, so in here he can buy what don't we have? We could get the snake charming basket, the incense holder. Which if we got those that would be like all of our money. Um You know what? We're gonna do it. We're not gonna have very much money, but we're gonna do it anyways. No, we're not gonna be able to buy very many recipes, which is what I wanted to, and the in the uh in the skill books because we don't have only like a hundred dollars really. But we might be able to buy some stuff. So let's just see. Come on, buddy. Uh -huh. Let us see what you got. Alright, so the recipes, wow, they are really expensive. They're like, wow. Um, this is 750 Dang. We could buy the photography. We don't want those ones. So we still need about um, 750 About another 1400 1500 still. Alright, we may have to do... Let's see, you got anything to sell? Well, you can get rid of that. I can tell you that much. Um, 23 bucks is not very much, so that's not going to help us. Um, we could sell this and this camera. We can always buy a new one. Now, that's still not quite enough. 
Let's see if we can s go get some of the harvestables first. Uh, where's the harvestables? They are right here. Alright, we are going to get him to come harvest here. Alright, buddy. Come on over. Come harvest over here. Um, in here there is uh, pomegranates and plums and stuff that we don't have at home. Oh look, there's also a snake. Catch the snake first. And then let's harvest. We, we can sell the snake and get the money from it. Ow! Oh, I don't think he caught it. Nope, he was bitten. Well, you know what, buddy? You just lost out on some money. Alright, so we're going to speed him through this. Alright, we're getting pomegranates, watermelons, things like that. Which are good. And... Yeah, he harvested a grapevine, a plum tree, a watermelon, pomegranate tree, grapevine. Yeah, he's just harvesting a lot of the same stuff. Grapes, we don't really need. We can sell those and get some money from them. Because he's got 15 right now, so that's a lot of grapes. Now he's doing tomatoes, which we can get at home. We don't need those. We can get watermelons at home, so we don't need those. Pretty much we're just doing this to, um, get money. Alright, buddy. What you got here? Lime tree, apple tree. Mm, apple tree, apple tree. Alright. You know what? There is a butter, there's butterflies here that you could catch to sell. I know they're not very much, but, hey, every dime counts. Alright. Catch those butterflies. You can catch those butterflies. Alright, we're going to sell this. We're going to sell these. What's this? Plum, pomegranate. We can sell tomatoes. We can sell these limes. And these apples. Alright, so we should have pretty close to what we need. Now let's head back down to the market. All right, buddy, come on. What are you doing playing online? Get off of that thing. That was not meant for that, but you know what? I'm going to sell it if you don't knock it off. All right. Let's see. Fast forward a little bit. All right, come on. All right, we are at the market officially, and we need to go to the bookstore again and buy the rest of the books. Um, Bye. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. He needs a shower. He needs some food. Oh boy. Alright, buddy. Let's see. What can we get here? Now, I know that one. We already got that one. The fishing is really expensive. Let's hopefully see if we can get them all. Yeah, see, we can't get them all yet. But, we can get the two most expensive, then we just gotta get another, like, um, three, that's 325 for that. We have about a hundred bucks here. Let's see, what do we got else? What else we got in here? Uh, nothing really. Alright, well... He's gonna need some food. He needs a shower. What is there around here that we can use? Um, yeah, I'm not seeing too much here. There's no showers here to use or anything. We're going to have to go home to the base, go back to the base camp and take care of our needs. And let's see. First off, let's get him to eat. And let's see, what's he need? What can he eat, buddy? You can have some autumn salad. That's fine. And you need to use the bathroom. Alright, come on. You need to shower. You don't really need to go to the bathroom itself. But let's see. Can we see anything around here to sell? I'm just going to turn the view. See if we can sell anything. Or find anything on the ground to sell. Come on. 
There we go. Uh, what's that? We can pick the blue fox and sell that. That's certainly not enough, but it's a good start. Um, yeah, we're pretty much plum dry. But you know what? There's actually this thing right here. And what you can do is we can go inside and we can collect the things that we need to. And, and uh, hopefully there's a money bag in there that we can collect. Oh, you know what? There's also a Sweet William, which is probably... We might not have to do that. We might just be able to collect the Sweet William and sell that and get the money that we need. Alright, buddy. Come on. Arm salad for dinner. Make it up. Good work. He is at level... Uh, I think he's at level one. Yeah, he just learned how to cook. But that's alright. Alright, buddy. Come on. Oh, blue thog. Oh, yeah, but you're gonna eat. go take a shower to get that hygiene up. Come on, take a shower. He's getting tired. That's why he's having a fit. He's getting tired, but he needs a. Uh, I didn't intend on staying here the whole time just to come here to get that money but it wasn't even really worth it we spent more to get over here than we did to bring him that book but you know what it's okay we're getting some other stuff that we needed so we'll be alright alright mm. come on get this alright let's see I don't know if that one went into his inventory yet all right, let's see. Let's sell these. That's two hundred. He needed three twenty-five, and we got three seventeen. There's got to be something around here we can pick and pick and sell. <laughs> All right, what's up here? Look at that stuff. What's that? Collect that. Pick that. Oh, that's worth it right there. And you know what? We're going to excavate this. Excavate. Go ahead, buddy. Come on up here and do that. Then we'll head to the market and we'll, head, we'll send you home. He found copper. It's valued at $28. Alright, well that's good. I don't think he's got the tent on him, so he can't even sleep with it. That cosmos is worth a lot. Alright, $600 in our pocket. All right, can you excavate this, please? What's he listening to? A fishing tab cast. Well, you know what? Since he's tired, we're just going to let him go take a nap because he won't excavate that and we want to... Well, actually, just let him sleep. All right, I'll come back when Gustav has woken up from sleeping and we'll go excavate that quickly and then we'll head over to the market and buy the last book that we need and be on our way home. See you then. Alright, so Gustav is on his way over here. It's 7 in the morning. He is going to excavate this, which you get relics out of, which are a lot of times worth a ton of money. So let's get him to excavate that quickly. Let's see what he's getting. He found a cut ruby worth at least 140. Um, he found some silver valued at 54. All right, speed up a little bit here, buddy. Uh, oh. Um, mm. what's that? Mm. Oh. He found some trash. Mm. Oh, oh, that's that's delicious. Mm. Um, he found some more trash. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and he found a relic worth 123. All right. I don't know what happens if you clean these up. I don't know where he takes them to. But since he made the mess, he might as well clean it up. And then he throws it back on the ground. Oh, it cleans it by itself. Alright, let's go up to the top view. And we are going to uh, visit Al Samhara. And you know what? Just before we go home, I want to check those plants again and see if they've got more fruit on them. Since we sold a lot of it, plus also because... Um, yeah, see, they got more fruit on them. We're going to have to go harvest them again. Get some more of the uh, plums and stuff that you can't get at the actual hometown. And we'll be able to make good money. 
Alright, come on, buddy. Down there to that market. Alright, now. Where's the book one? It's over here. I think. Yeah, so we need to buy from here. Go ahead, go buy from here. Alright. Get the last book, and then you'll be good. If you have enough money. Oh yeah, they will have plenty of money left over. Let's get them to buy some food. You know what? What was the one that we needed? The recipe, right? 325. Alright, let's get him to buy some food because he's hungry. Come on, buddy. And before he leaves, let's get him to use the bathroom as well. Come on. Alright, um... We could have him have some Raymond, actually. Alright, eat your Raymond. That actually looks really good. Makes me want Raymond noodles now. Alright, buddy. You gotta clean this up, too, when you're done. You can't just leave it here. What happened? I don't know how he cleaned that up, but... Come on, come use the bathroom. Are we clicking on the girls? Ah... We must, way. Uh, we must be clicking on the girls one. Yep, we were. Alright, wash your hands. There's someone. Let's let him dance for a little bit. Come on, buddy, let's go dance. <laughs> There's the snake. You can see it. Right there. Here, we'll give him a tip. Come on, buddy. Go give him a tip. Then we got some place else to go. 87? Wow, we didn't need to give him that much of a tip, but okay. Um, Where'd that place go? I always get turned around up here. Come on. Here it is. Alright. So. Let's come get him to uh, harvest this another time. And then after that we can head on home because we ain't really got anything else to do. She's going to be the one to have to do the adventures. Just because if she isn't then she won't get the visa points she needs to finish her life too much. Report. Business abroad. Murky Corp is working on a business opportunity with the Egyptian government to find three ancient relics in Al Samhara. The work will be dangerous but quite profitable. Interested Sims should report to Fahad Madbuli for more information. Get treasure and visa points for this. You know what? Sure. Well, we can report in. Since he got it on his phone, it's a little bit different, I think. I don't think it's the a one of the actual adventures. It might be, but... Well, we'll just do it anyways. Give him a little something to do. And then... See, he's going to take all this home with him. All these vegetables and all these fruits. And either she can choose to plant them when one of her other plants dies, or she can choose to sell them, whichever she wants to do. At least we're getting them, though, so she has the opportunity. All right, buddy. Report in now. And you didn't get everything here. Oh, that's all right. You got the most important ones, I think. Well, he missed some of the some of the pomegranates and plums, but that's okay. He's tired. He needs hygiene, too. So he probably just wants to go home, and that's probably what he wants. He's pretty much just pretty much going to do is try and keep going home. All right, buddy, come on. Oh, what are you? Full of God. Yeah. All right, so we have to enter the tomb of discovery and find the missing papers. Oh. So go visit the tomb of discoveries. Oh. Go ahead. We'll follow you. And he's got some food. He might want to eat one of them. He's getting pretty hungry. Um, eat. That was not what I wanted you to do. Eat a morsel when you get this. You know what? This is at the base camp. So you know what? We're not that far from home. You know what we should do? We should just go and have him uh, 
take a shower and take a nap because this is not going to take very long down there so once he's done down there we'll be pretty much good um, yeah this one doesn't take very long and the first thing you gotta do is go through this here well nope that's not what I meant go through this door alright I'm gonna fast forward come back when he's ready to go through alright guys so he is here we're gonna pick up these coins open this up and uh, yeah. Alright, come on. Take it. Insert the keystone here. Alright, come on, buddy. Alright, go through this door. Uh, stand on this. Go down the stairs. Stand on this. Go on through the store. You're gonna pull this and then pull far. Come on. One more, come on. You're good. Now go on through this door. Now see, we gotta turn our view. We gotta pull this. Pull it. Stand on this. Go on through. And we're there. We've already finished it. There's a door there you gotta inspect. Alright, take those papers. Open this. No. Alright, he's just about got it. Alright, open this. Collect this. Take that. All right, use these stairs. There's a treasure chest over here that you gotta open, and then you stand on this, and then you can go deliver the papers. Yeah. Alright, so we are on our way to go deliver these papers quickly to this guy, and then we're probably going to just, I don't know, it's 3 in the morning, he is exhausted, he needs to eat something after he delivers these papers, so we'll get him to eat a morsel, and then it's pretty much, he needs to go either to bed or to home, and we're probably just going to have him travel home, just because it's easier and he is exhausted. He's probably going to pass out. But we are finally here. He finally ran the whole way. Cool be All right, buddy. Mm -hmm. Nib crim. Couple up. Pretty sure that's the end. Oh no, it's not. Oh my. Gordon. Oh. He is not going to be a very happy person. But you know what? That's what happens. When you do an adventure, there's a million pieces to it. All right, buddy. You're Moody exhausted, hot. and mm -hmm. she's got the studying mood lit there. All right. Find four pieces of turquoise. You know what? He's going to have to go to sleep, or he's going to pass out. I don't even see any turquoise, to be honest. So... All right. Here's one. Let's have you collect that. Collect the spotted turtle. We're just going to sell it. But it's money. Um, here, there's something here you can collect. There's a chipmunk there you can catch. 
What is up with all the animals being next to the gems that we need? Alright, come on. Where are they? Here's one. And when he gets there, he can sleep, and then we'll catch this. Well, you know what? I should be letting him do that stuff, and I'm not. Alright, pick the black-eyed Susan. Collect that, and then you're going to need to excavate that. Hurry up, buddy. Please do not pass out. He probably will. Excavate that. Let's sell that turtle before it gets away. 332. Heck to the yeah. Alright. Oh, he's passing out. Alright, he's up now. Chipmunk. Catch that chipmunk so we can sell it. Alright, 109. Woo! We're on a roll. Alright. He is coming over here. He is going to sleep now. I'm going to wake him up when he's got enough where he can get up and do this stuff. Because I'm not sleeping all day. Alright, come on. He needs two more pieces of turquoise. Well, you know what? Let's go collect one more. Right here. You know what? There's actually two gems here. Alright, buddy. You got enough there. Come on. Get up. Let's go. Fast forward. Fast forward. Come on. Excavate that out. And he is getting stuff from there. He's got turquoise. Turquoise. A relic. Another relic. Another relic. And he is eating a pomegranate. That little stubborn little butt. Alright, if you're that hungry, then why don't you eat something that you can actually have? Instead of eating the things that we don't want you to eat, eat a morsel. Hurry up. Get over here. And you gotta deliver your gems. Because you've got them all already. Come on. You're not that tired. Alright. Eat your morsel. Now let's hurry up. Get your stuff in to this lady. This is probably going to be a long run because he's like on the other side of the, f the whole entire Egypt. Alright. Thank God he's got that Ken spot. Oh, we're back to running. Alright. we got to be getting pretty close here. Oh, jeez. No, we're not. This is the second time we've had to uh, ride that Ken spa. And we're there, finally. <laughs> it only took us three <laughs> hours, though it seemed like a minute, but it took three hours. Chaka bro, cave. Mm -hmm. Nice nah. to. Oh my. Alright, we're not doing that part. Oh. We're just gonna oh. return home now. Average. No. Stop getting to know her. We do not care about her. Um, we're gonna return home, and this is where I'm gonna end this video for today. Thanks for watching, guys. If you liked it, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up and leave a comment and subscribe for the next episode. Thanks for watching.